Hi, this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson. We have Martin here with us today, and he was referred in by his brother, and this is his very first trip to a chiropractor ever. We've already done the orthopedic neurological examination on him, and it does show that he has mechanical or biomechanical misalignments or subluxations in his cervical spine, thoracic spine, and lumbar spine and pelvis. So we're going to check his posture now. I'm going to have you close your eyes again and flex your head forward and backwards for me, Martin. And then neutral. Back to normal. There you go. Now, as you can see, his head's a little forward and a little bit to the right. That's why his left shoulder appears a little higher. It's not really higher. It just looks that way because his head's over to the right. Now, his pelvis is over to the left. He's got less room over on this side than he does over here. And Martin, take a look at that. You see how your head's forward and to the right? Okay. That makes your left shoulder a little higher, and that's right where you're feeling all that muscle tightness there. Right. That's what's pulling on that muscle. Okay. And then your pelvis is shifted over this way too, and that's why you're having that left side pain down here. So he gets some neck pain and headaches, as well as his upper back here, and down his lower back and pelvis that goes all the way down into his legs and his toes with numbness and tingling. So we're going to do his first adjustment, and this is going to be your ring dinger of the day. Okay, here we go. Martin, I'm going to have you lay on your back right here. Head this way for me, please. And don't tell him anything. All right. You'll feel like you're about an inch taller here in just a second. Now scoot up just a little bit where your hips right underneath that pin. Side. Yeah, it's going to feel tight. Does that feel like you're in there good? Yeah, I'm really, really If you really push good. away, and make sure you don't slide up there. Before. Really, really good. Yeah. He's in there tight. He's not going to get away. And we're scaring him. Yeah, that's where we are. Can I hold on to this? No, you can just relax your hands right there. Yeah, I haven't got any heads on my trophy wall yet. I won't start with yours. <laughs> okay, I am going to put a uh, decompression in your spine so you're going to feel some traction in your spine. I'm going to put this under your skull and this around your jaw. Keep your teeth together. Take a deep breath in. Let all your out. Keep your teeth together. Oh, oh. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you feel that all the way down? All the way down. That's a ring dinger. There we go. I'll get those out for you. <laughs> uh, he's here. Relax your legs. He's still kicking. <laughs> that, 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 Got that all the way down, huh? That was crazy. Yep. Okay, let me have you here. Yeah, there you go. Tilt right a little bit. That's oh, it. Dang. Now tilt left a little. Oh, yeah. Good. Remember, he's never this seen a car right right there. Well, we're going to get rid of his headache and his pain. Yeah. I didn't think that was possible. All that. <laughs> it's almost as tough as boxing now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's come over this way. I'll help you up sideways this way. There we go. Okay, Martin, I'm going to have you lay on your stomach here again. Put your face up in here. It gets easier from here on out. <laughs> I don't know what to do. <laughs> now, see, look, his legs are even now, though. They weren't before. That tightens up a little bit right there at your low back, doesn't it? Yep. So his pelvis raised up right here, especially on this left side. That's tender right there, huh? Okay, keep breathing. There you go. We're adjusting his left sacroiliac joint now, and then I'm going to get on the sacrum right here in the center, and then the right SI joint over here. And now I'm on L5, straight PDA. L4, L3, L2, all the way up to L1, and now just breathe normal for me, Martin, and just relax. There we go. Put some light pressure in here. That's it. That's it. Good. And just keep breathing. Just keep breathing. There we go. Good job. Felt that one, didn't you? Yes, I did. All right, so now you're going to feel your head pop up a little bit. And just relax this. I'm going to adjust your neck curve.
curve back in here for you so we can get that curve going back forward in your neck. There's C56. And there's C67 right there. Okay, let's turn you on your back now. Hey, he's still moving. <laughs> All right. We'll be moving even better after this, my friend. You've been wanting to go out and play some ball tonight. <laughs> Go and drink beer, huh? <laughs> there we go. I survived. <laughs> there we go. Good. Now let's slide you down this way. The reason we've been a little lax on our videos this week because Joseph's out of town. So you can blame Joseph for the lack of videos. Because <laughs> I've been too busy. Yep. Let's slide up just a little bit this way. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Just like that. Uh -huh. Now you're going to feel your upper back kind of popping up here. I'm going to get your shoulders. There's the AC joint, and now I'm going to adjust your clavicle where it attaches to your sternum. And now your ribs. There we go. There we go. Good. See, he paid me extra to do all this extra. <laughs> There you go. Did you feel that all the way from your low back? Yeah. Okay. Good. There you go. Yeah, you're feeling taller now, aren't you? I'm going to stay up here and face out the window. Look for the straight. All right, you know what? Let's turn around and face toward your neck. We'll get a better picture that way. So we'll have to be looking at my backside. Ooh, you feel that shoulder grinding? Yeah. That's, that's, that's the way you're talking about? Both of them. Okay. There's your right shoulder back in place. Ooh, this one's a lot worse. You feel that right there? Yep. When I get up to the top? Okay, good. <laughs> yep, I won't break your elbow, I promise. <laughs> yeah, I thought you guys going to adjust you from head to toe. Okay, just keep breathing. There we go. <laughs> That's it. There we go. Good. Okay, let's have you stand up in front of the mirror for me again now. Did Andrew tell you that I was going to shoot you too? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> okay, this is what it's going to feel like. It's a little tap. This is the last adjustment that we do to make sure we're retraining your brain how to hold you in this position. See how you're more centered right now? Yeah, I can see my arms. Yeah, and even on both sides. Yeah, yep. he, he thinks more or less of... Uh, his head does, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's bend your head forward and backwards again, Martin. Remember how that felt? Back to neutral. Okay, take a look. Now here's your exercise. You're going to lift up with your shoulders. You're going to pull back simultaneously. Flare these guys like this. And then to get rid of the forward head posture, see we're going to bring the head straight back this way. You were a little bit right, so we're going to go left. And now shift your pelvis straight over towards Andrew there. Lift your chin up to the ceiling. You're going to feel a little tap there. Another little tap there. Now relax. And try that same thing again. See if this feels a little smoother, like put a little WD-40 in there. Mm -hmm. That's better, isn't it? Yeah. Take a look at now, neutral. Yeah, you're standing up, your shoulders are square right now? Good. That's good. All right, so <laughs> tell our YouTube subscribers how that felt for your first ring dinger. That, that, was, that was tough, but it felt good. It's a ring dinger, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. You got them all, didn't it? Yeah, all the way down. To, to the butt, right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> and we got his head lined up and his tail in. So he's got a front end misalignment and a rear end misalignment. <laughs> and this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnston, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief in Houston, Texas. We'll see you next time.